AWS Savings Plans is a flexible pricing model offering lower prices compared to on-demand pricing in exchange for a one or three year usage commitment. Hi guys, this is Abhi from Goksha DB. And in this video, you're going to learn seven things about the savings plans in AWS. Let's get into it. Number one, AWS offers three different types of savings plans, compute, EC2 instance, and SageMaker. Compute savings plans apply to usage across EC2, Lambda, and Fargate, whereas the EC2 instance and SageMaker savings plans apply to EC2 and SageMaker usage respectively. Number two, compute savings plans provide the most flexibility and can reduce your costs by up to 66%. Within these plans, you can move a workload from EC2 to Fargate or Lambda at any time and still continue to pay the savings plans price. Number three, EC2 instance savings plans provide the lowest prices, offering savings of up to 72% in exchange for a commitment to the usage of individual instance families in a region. Number four, Amazon SageMaker savings plans can help to reduce your costs by up to 64%. These plans automatically apply to eligible SageMaker ML instance usages, including SageMaker Studio Notebook, SageMaker Training, and SageMaker Real-Time Inference. Number five, you can get started with savings plans from AWS Cost Explorer in the Management Console using the AWS CLI or by making simple API calls. To realize the biggest savings, follow the recommendations provided in the AWS Cost Explorer. Number six, after you sign up for a savings plan, your compute usage will automatically be charged at the discounted savings plans prices and any usage beyond your commitment will be charged at regular on-demand rates. Last but not the least, number seven. By default, the benefit provided by savings plans applies to usage across all accounts within an AWS organization or consolidated billing family. In summary, AWS savings plans provide significant cost savings of up to 72% compared to on-demand prices. There you have it. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment section below. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell. Until next time.